Welcome to the Disabled Podcast, starring your host, Christian Reitz. Hot dog! Let's go! Welcome to the Disabled Podcast, the show that incorporates disabilities with the magic of Disney. Welcome to episode number two, entitled, The Disabled Podcast Story. Be sure to use our brand new hashtag, hashtag the Disabled Podcast, when sharing this podcast to all social media platforms. Again, that's hashtag the Disabled Podcast when sharing this podcast to all social media platforms. And now, here's your host, Christian Reitz. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Disabled Podcast, episode number two. In today's podcast, I want to talk about my love for Disney and a little bit really of how this podcast got started, the Disabled Podcast. So I actually want to travel back to the year 2001, where my love for Disney first got started. So my very first trip to Walt Disney World was actually granted to me by one of the best organizations in the world, and that is the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Now, for those of you that may not know what the Make-A-Wish Foundation does, they basically grant wishes to terminally ill children and their families. And that could be anything from, you know, meeting a celebrity, uh, going on a vacation, or heck, even getting your own tree house. But um, yeah, so basically Make-A-Wish was really what started my exposure to Disney World. So what they did for our family was they gave us uh, a free vacation. Uh, so they paid for everything, whether that was the food or, or that was uh, the, the, you know, the theme park tickets. They did it all for us. So we stayed at a special place called Give Kids the World Village. And uh, Give Kids the World Village is literally what it sounds like. It's a village for kids. Um, they have an ice cream parlor and they have this and that and this and that and they have just all kinds of cool things. They have mini golf and, and just, I can't, I don't remember all that they have because it's been so long since I've been there. But actually, that's actually really what sparked my love. It sparked my love for Disney. Um, And even still today, 10 years later, even, yeah, about 10 years later, um, my love for Disney really has increased. In fact, it's gotten even larger um, because I actually joined my church's production team. And so my church's production team, I also, I run the lights. I run some of the video content uh, for my home church here in in my hometown. And um, yeah, so now when I go to Disney, I always look at, really my family thinks, my family thinks I'm a little crazy. I always look at the the behind the scenes. I always want to look at how they made this show and how they, you know, do this kind of effect and that kind of effect and how they do. I, you know, just the mechanics of this ride and that ride and, and, and just all sorts of things. And so that's really a little bit about how my journey for Disney got started. So every year we take a family trip to Walt Disney World and we always, um, we always have a good time. And it's, it's about 14 people on the trip. So I know you're thinking it's kind of crazy. It's 14 people, but it really is 14 people on the trip every year um, that we get to go. And so uh, I can't wait to go back personally for my uh, next trip. But um, that's just a little bit about how my love for Disney theme parks got started. And again, like I said, it's increasing day by day. I can't tell you how many times I've been to Disney. It's been that much. Um, but I just love going back every year. And so kind of, kind of talking about that, you know, a lot of people ask me nowadays, at least a lot of my friends, they ask me, well, Christian, how did the, uh, the podcast get started? And that's actually another interesting story. So my brother back, I think it was about three years ago, had been telling me, hey, man, you need to start doing a podcast or or, or even asking the question, hey, what do you think about doing a podcast? And I was like, well, I I really, I I mean, it sounds cool, but I'm more the, you know, videographer type of guy. So I make videos and, and, and music, whatnot. So I'm not really the podcast type of person and he was like well that's okay you don't have to be the you know the podcast type of guy you just gotta you know you gotta have a mic gotta have a recording program gotta know what to say gotta have a topic and and all that so he really got me into um my brother really got me into the the whole podcast business and so I've been wanting to do that for uh, a couple years now and um, I just now kind of got around to it and again I have a job so it's not really um, it really wasn't that simple for me to get around to doing that stuff. But now that I've had a lot more experience with, um, with my church's production team and recording and all of that, 
it's definitely gotten a lot easier, I would say. Um, yeah, it's just gotten, I, I don't know, it's just so much fun. But um, yeah, my love for Disney has not honestly changed that much. Um, it's just gotten bigger and better. So next episode, what I'm going to do, in fact, next few episodes, what I want to do is I want to actually take you through some of uh, just the way I would do the theme parks, um, whether you're in a wheelchair. And, and again, this doesn't have to apply to whether or not you're in a wheelchair. It can apply to anybody. So whether you're in a wheelchair or not, you can learn something so much from this podcast. And that's really my hope is that you will learn something uh, just from listening to this podcast, that you will be able to take what I've said and adapt it to your needs, uh, whether you're a family with a child who has a special need or, or disability or whatnot. My, my hope is that you will take what I say uh, in this podcast and you'll just run with it and just make the Disney vacations that you go on, whether it's Disney World, Disneyland, or the cruise line. Uh, you'll just take this vacations and you'll just make it your own. So over the next few podcasts, what you're going to hear is you're going to hear a lot of me just explaining uh, my, just the way that I navigate the theme parks. And so I hope you'll join me next week for episode number three where I'm actually going to start talking about Disney transportation and uh, how this works in the theme parks. And then episodes four through seven, what I want to do is I want to take you through each of the theme parks individually, step by step, park by park, and actually tell you um, a little bit of the rides that I would suggest and uh, tell you a little bit about what each park is all about. So that way you and your family can plan the best theme park experience possible. Thank you for joining me for episode number two of the Disabled Podcast, and we'll see ya real soon.